passwordless login allows you to log into LastPass using the LastPass Authenticator app instead of entering your master password through a browser on your desktop. You can authenticate via the LastPass Authenticator app with push notifications and stored biometrics. Start by going under Account Settings in LastPass and selecting Multi-Factor Options. Here, we'll choose LastPass MFA. Under Action, we can edit the settings. We'll change Enabled to Yes and then Update. Confirm the change by entering your LastPass Master Password and then Continue. Once we're finished, we'll be able to enroll a device with the LastPass Authenticator. Now we'll set up Mobile App. We'll still need to install the LastPass Authenticator, which is available either from the App Store for Apple devices or Google Play for Android devices. Once we have the app installed, we can next use the QR code to pair the Authenticator. On your mobile device, open up the LastPass Authenticator and get started. We'll first be asked to enable notifications, which you must allow. Once we have, you can add account. We'll then need to OK access to the camera and then view the QR code. All right, now that the account's been added, we do have the option to also add biometric protection for the app itself by going to the settings cog and turning on the option. To complete this process, we'll also need to add a pin as backup. That's it on the app side. Speaking of backups, we'll still need to create a backup method should the LastPass Authenticator be unavailable. This can be text messaging or a YubiKey. We'll choose text messaging, enter a phone number, and then we'll confirm that phone number with a received code. Once we finish text setup, we can then activate two-factor authentication. Now that the LastPass Authenticator is up and running, we still need to add our passwordless option, which would be our start point if multi-factor authentication with the LastPass Authenticator was already enabled. From here, choose Enable Passwordless. Then from the options, we'll select Use LastPass Authenticator and enter in our master password. Once we're done, we can log out and try it now. We can log in from the website or use the browser extension. Here we'll enter our email address, and if we don't want to enter it ever again, we can go under Advanced Options and set the login to Remember Email. This is not recommended for public workstations, but once we're done, we simply then need to log in with Authenticator. We'll be notified on our mobile device to verify that login request. Once we've logged into our phone using our biometrics, we'll have about a minute to accept the request and verify it with our biometrics once again. Then, we're logged in. All right, well, that's it for passwordless login. For more questions on LastPass, please check out support.lastpass.com.